All right, how's everyone doing? This is my first Axial build. Um, I'm excited to show you guys here in a second, but before I do, I'd, I'd like to say, strangely, I originally hated the Unimog, and I, I just hated the way that it looked. That short wheelbase always had me intrigued, but the Unimog, I thought it looked ugly at first. But a couple weekends ago at the Great Lakes Gauntlet, there was a couple of them there, and after seeing them run in person, the Unimog really grew on me. So now a couple weekends later, I've decided to build another kit, and I, I picked the Unimog. I really want that short wheelbase uh, difference. So I decided to try that, and it also, um, since I'm used to the TRX-4s and I have a Red Cat um, Gen 8, I'm used to the portals, so this is my first something without portals. Uh, you'll see an example of uh, me getting stuck about without them, but uh, so look forward to that up ahead in a minute. But uh, just two complaints right off the bat before we get into it. Uh, you'll everything you'll see here is stock footage, so the truck is stock the way basically that it comes with all the parts. Um, Tell you the electronics here in a second and show you under the hood but uh the two complaints that i have right off the bat is a high center of gravity and of course i'm not helping myself with the 3s uh 5000 milliamp bricks but uh and then my other complaint is the stock tires and they just don't seem to grip for me you'll you'll probably see a few spots up ahead where i i probably could have gripped a little better and easier if, if the tires were better. So strangely I've heard good things about the tires but I just didn't care for them and my fix to both those issues is I got another set of uh, the Proline BF Goodrich crawler tires. It's what I'm running on every single truck so far other than my Red Cat. Um, but those, the BF Goodrich crawlers have done amazing for me, every single truck. So I'm going to keep rolling with them. And then uh, for the weight issue, to, to lower my weight on the truck, I got the Boom Racing High Mass Rims. And if you haven't checked those out, go check them out. Uh, they're amazing. That's what I'm rocking on my TRX4 build, the Jeep that I got now and they man they really keep it down they help you side hill as long as that other rim doesn't go over, like it really holds you down man but uh so I, I kind of want to just get right into it but uh can't forget to show you let you check it out here a second I was very happy with the way that turned out now, under the hood here, we have the, oh, what is that, the Hobbywing 1080 uh, ESC. The motor is the Holmes Hobby uh, Trailmaster 550, the 27 turn. And let's see, I'm rocking like the Eco Power WP110T or something like that. Is it cheap? Somewhat cheap, decent server on A main. Um, so yeah, that's kind of what's under there. And then uh, these are the high mass rims. So yeah, this is with new tires, new rims on it. Again, what you'll see here in a second is 100% stock. So let's just let's get right into it. Let's go check out the footage of it on the trail. <laughs> 